It's Friday, and I hope this will focus. This is what we're doing Friday morning. Instead of making a video for you all, Kevin is reinstalling Windows 7, which... I'm trying to fix it. Trying to fix it. I do not look forward to any of this process. I've been getting, what, a blue screen? Mm -hmm. uh, a time after time after time, so... Kevin is my computer man, so he's going to make it right for me. Okay, Kevin waited an hour while I worked out on the elliptical, and then he um, installed Windows 7. It did not work. Well, I tried to restore Windows 7. It didn't work. Okay, so now what are you doing with the computer so, open? I have an extra hard drive. I had an extra hard drive here. And uh, so what I did was I unplugged our old hard drives, and plug the, the new hard drive in. I'm just going to install Windows 7, brand new, fresh copy of it. And then she has a backup on a hard drive, an external drive. So I'll restore that, and that should bring back all of the settings and the files. And I don't know how many programs. I may have to still install some programs and stuff, but anyway. Um, and then I can copy all of her videos and all that stuff off of the old hard drives onto the new one, and she'll have them right back to where they were. So... If, if you got an extra hard drive, it's just safer to unplug the old one, install it, and start all over again fresh. And uh, it'll probably work better for her anyway in the, for a while. I hope so. And Mr. Gavin is here. Oh, Say hi. I brought his high chair in here. And he is eating one of these biscuits that his mommy brought. He loves them. And he's actually drinking this. You can see the liquid. It's like a pink lemonade that his daddy loves. He saw me pick up that biscuits. So now he wants more. But guess what? You had this in your seat. So you can eat that before I give you another one. He, he dropped it down in there. So before I give you the new biscuit, you have to eat what you dropped. Gavin has discovered Guido's steps. We need a little railing here to keep him safe. Are you going to go to the top? And he's a little cranky because he hasn't had a nap yet. And it's almost 11. Get up there. Keep going. Yay. I sold back my textbooks for my college classes. And I received an Amazon, like a... Amazon gift card that you could redeem online for about forty dollars. Was it fifty? Fifty dollars. So I bought some books. Some of them for my school use, and some of them for my work use, not school. And then a few of them just for reading pleasure. So two of them came in today. I bought them used, and so they came from all different places. So these are two, and I think I got about five of them. I don't want to cut my book. It's the sticky packaging, so it doesn't want to... This is The Selection by Kira Cass. And I heard good things about it. It had really great reviews. This book only cost me $3, I think. Didn't say. No, it doesn't say, and I don't want to show our address. Um, I think this one cost me $3 in shipping. So total, this book was 6 I think, when normally it would be $10 in store. So, And it's brand new. It's in perfect condition. And then this one. This one back. Well, ew, ew, gross. Met side side. Oh. <laughs> what is that? Packing. <coughs> dead cat. Gross. It's dead cat. Yeah, really. And then this is Demi Lovato's new book, Staying Strong 365 Days a Year. This one I bought full price because I wanted it not to be written in. Books like these, I like to write my own notes in them, so I didn't want it, I didn't want the chance of it being written in. When you buy them used off Amazon, you can never be totally 100% sure that they're not going to be some way damaged unless you buy them new. 
So let's talk about this one. Well, Kevin and I just left Kroger, um, and we spent $65, which is amazing, but drinks were on sale four for 11. So we bought four Coke Zeros and then four um, uh, Diet uh, Mountain Dews because the yard sells tomorrow and Andrew drinks a lot. So we made sure that we stocked up. Um, and this car in front of us could turn and they're not. So anyway, um, I'll show you what we bought uh, when I get home. I'm not gonna do a formal like haul, like a separate video, just because we bought a lot of multiples. So it would be a very boring haul. <laughs> um, but Kevin has worked all day long, literally all day long on my computer trying to get it up. And of course the most important component to me of that is the movie maker and it's not working it is um the movie maker that i am used to crashes every time we bring it up so i'm going to have to um use a different program and i, I don't know how that's going to go um i will probably end up getting very frustrated because i do not like change at all um I don't like change and I, I don't care to learn anything a new program so um, but I'll, I have a feeling Kevin is gonna be sitting next to me tonight to try to make some videos because I do need to make um, I wanted to make another video today I know I already put two up today but I wanted to put an, an additional one up um, of something else but uh, I have to make two tonight. We'd like to make three. We'll see how it goes. Maybe by the third one, I'll be used to it and he won't have to sit next to me. But I know that's not how he wanted to spend his Friday, so I'm very thankful that he can do it. Do you want to explain what you had to go through to get my computer back up and running? It's been horrible. I said I put a new hard drive in. Yeah, I yes. already said I installed a new hard drive. But then you're, he's having to put all these programs back on yeah. and, and you don't realize how many programs you have and even when you think you have them all, then then you have to install things like the printer. Yeah, or Java. Yeah, things that you just don't realize that your computer uses in the background all the time every day, these little things that you pull up, uh, you take for granted that they're gonna be there um, that they like come with it or something they don't and you have to actually put them on so um, it has been an all-day process and um, so it hasn't been fun for me either because I haven't had my computer all day but um, um, anyway that's all for now and uh, like I said I'll show you what we bought uh, for $65 when I get home so we got the four Coke Zeros and the four Diet Mountain Dews I told you about. We also got uh, four of the uh, Skinny Cow Chocolate Mousse Ganache. Um, I um, had a coupon on one of them. And then in one of these bags, um, hold on, I'm trying to find it. I got a candy bar free from a coupon. So I'll show you that in a second. Cause, oh, here it is. Um, so I got uh, like a dollar off one, and then on another one, I got a free candy bar, which I've had these before, and they're really, they're really good. They're only 130 calories. And then I bought two of the Pepperidge Farm uh, four cheese. Um, they were on sale, so I thought I'd go ahead and get two. And then this was the free Friday. Uh, these are mini pancakes. They also had waffles. And then... Ashley wanted some uh, popcorn that she could put in the deep fryer. And then Eric, I hope I bought the right kind. You had mentioned um, Bluebell. Uh, it had cheesecake in the name. So, and I thought it was this caramel turtle cheesecake. You said it was really good. So I hope this is the right kind. Uh, it was on sale. It had been like seven twenty something. The Bluebell. It was on sale for five ninety nine. So I got it while I could. So hopefully this is the kind you were talking about. If not, then uh, sit, leave me another comment and tell me uh, where I went wrong. So hoping this is it though. But that's all we bought at Kroger. As I said, a lot of multiples of stuff. 
we brought the wood downstairs and we are in the driveway assembling the tables and like Kevin said they only have to last for one day uh, for the yard sale and then they will be gone um, they're gonna be very thin tables though um, not like conference tables that's okay though um, hopefully we uh, have enough to um, for all of our stuff that's the only concern that I have um, and there's another one and we do have another one here that we're going to put together and we have two uh, we have the tables up on the porch and then we have a couple of round ones too so this isn't all just these three we do have more so and then we moved our cars at the end of the driveway what yeah it'll work nobody should be leaning on it anyway yeah it's fine no <laughs> Wouldn't want to tap dance on it, but it's fine. Out back, we have our ladders laid out. We have two. Kevin has the pole that we will put our hang our clothes across. The ladders are for the clothes tomorrow. Um, this table will be taken out front, and I have a lounge chair that this goes with that I'm selling. And then I'll show you what we did. We have done out front. Okay, so we pulled the table up from around the side of the porch, and we're going to use this little table too, and we brought the box downstairs, and we put all of the tables together, and we forgot we only made three legs for three tables. So we have our three tables here, but then Kevin brought down four pieces of wood. Well, we couldn't remember what the fourth piece of wood was for, so I said, well, I'll tell you what, I'll utilize this piece of wood. Let's put nails in it, and I will hang some of the stuff that came um, that I had that was on the kitchen wall, and I'll hang it here to display. Then we got in the back room, and I suddenly remembered where the fourth table was. We were going to use the existing, the pre-existing saw horses um, for the fourth table. So, but both of us forgot about that, and Kevin thinks we're going to have enough anyway. So. I don't think we will. I don't think you ever have enough table space, but I have to, um, I have to go with him on this one. It is 9.42 and I'm just now eating my crackers, my salty snack, and Kevin got my computer up and running for me. Yay! And even my media program, my movie maker, and I'm thrilled. So, I'm saving the movie for tomorrow. This will be, this will go up Saturday. And uh, so, very, very, very happy. Very grateful to have Kevin.